from smaller communities get left out. You know, we we tend to go to the the bigger cities. That's where like for instance, companies want you know people to go, and you know you can only go to Vancouver and Toronto so many times. And I think it's important to to be able to reach as many kids as possible. And I think this is a a wonderful opportunity to do that. Not a lot of people, you know, go into the smaller communities up north, um, and for us, it, it was a no-brainer. We're so lucky to be up here and, and to meet these incredible kids. I mean, they're so passionate, and even sitting down and talking to them in a small group, they're just so intelligent, and they just have so much drive for life, and so it's really important for us to be able to come up here and, you know, to show them that they can really do anything they put their mind to. It doesn't matter where they're from. I kind of see myself in them, you know, they're just so driven, and they're just kind of like sponges. They want to learn and, you know, pick your brain, and... If we can, you know, inspire one or two or all of them, I mean, you know, we're doing our jobs as athletes and as role models. It's cool having somebody and like an all-star coming to a small town like this, or in Saskatchewan. When you see that they've succeeded and done so much of their lives, what do you think about what you could do? Um, I feel like I could push myself and try my best to do the best I can in everything. These kids are remarkable. Um, you know, they the way they appreciate everything they have. Um, it, it, the response you get here is not the same response you'd get in a Vancouver or Toronto. Uh, Christine Sinclair stated that you should find your passion, whether it's uh, education, whether it's athletics or uh, different fields. If find your passion and pursue that passion because one of the things she said is if you can find your passion you can go to work and not even feel like you're at work. You're just pursuing your dreams, your goals and your ambition and I just love that message. It's something that we hope that all our students would work towards is finding their passion and pursuing it.